He's on that dumb level. Alright. Let's just head here. <laughs> I know exactly what the alien did. <laughs> What's up, guys? Israel here, and Merry Christmas. Anyways, to celebrate Christmas, we are gonna play this Christmas horror game. And it is called Crimson Snow. Now, I actually never played this game before. Yep, yeah, no joke. I just bought this game today. Um, I'm just excited. So, anyways, let's go. Oh, the phone. Hmm. Hi, handsome. What have you been up to while your better half wasn't around? Cute. Hi, Joyce. I finished a lot of paperwork and watched a lot of TV shows. I'm warning you, Mark, if you watch the third season of Dark Vengeance without me, there will be blood. We've already finished it. Blood! So I'll be home sooner than you think. I took a bunch of pics, just like you asked. Let me send you one right now. What do you want to see? My photo in the mountains or from the pool? I forgot to say that hotel had a luxurious swimming pool. Um. Picture in mind, let's do it. The weather was amazing. There was almost no wind. It was a perfect time for snowboarding. It's too bad that negotiations took so long. And there it is, right there. That's cool. You should have gone with me. I know that you don't like meeting new people, but I'm worried about you, Mark. I'm pretty much the only person you talk to. It's Christmas Eve, and no one's even congratulated you yet. I wonder why, though. I wonder. Did someone write you a personal letter? That's so cool. Open it up and tell me what's inside. Yeah. It's near the entrance, right? Right. Honey, I miss you so much. It's a pity that everything ended so badly. I'm ready you to give us another chance. Door, right? Yes. Maybe I did some stupid things before. But I won't do them again. It's a pinky promise. Let's meet and discuss everything, okay? Hmm. Well, who's it from? What did they write? Oh. I hope you don't have any problems with your taxes. I don't want my boyfriend to be locked up before we can meet again. By the way, about You lie, Joyce is worried about go you. Up to your bedroom window. Up to my bedroom window. Alright. Why is there a flickering light over there? Your girlfriend doesn't mess around with lights. She subtly hints to her obtuse boyfriend that she returned from the Alps. Now, on to the second part of my surprise. But first, show me your festive mood. Maybe I'll just come to you right away. Hold on a second. No, 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 Mr. Grinch. Show me where Christmas The Grinch? First. You had sparklers in your closet, didn't you? Light them up in front of this window. Alright, we're heading in here. I'm sorry I didn't come to your home right away, but I had to prepare something. You'll see it. If you find the sparklers, light one of them up by the bedroom window so I can see it. Alright. Alright, there's one right there. Um... Also one right there. Four of them. Alright, hold that. Why'd I say hold? Is. Just now press. I can feel the Christmas spirit. Alright, here's the second part of the surprise. Do you remember that French wine you wanted to buy? Until you saw the price tag? Today? We'll try it out. I also got some fireworks. So take your sparklers and come over. Let's celebrate Christmas together. Okay. By the way, I brought you a present. Oh. Did you get me something too? Come on, don't pretend that you haven't planned something. 
I know that you were preparing for the holidays even before my trip. It's probably already under the tree, so take your secret gift and come over. The longer you wait, the greater the chance that I'll drink all near wine by myself. Take your gift and come to see me. Okay. It's under the tree, isn't it? Hmm, I think. Are you sure that you have a present? Mark, there is. Be upset if you didn't buy one. A proposal. Just, if you found the gift, come I wonder why. Alright, now we're heading out. Else? It's easy to get lost in this weather. Follow the light, handsome. I'm waiting for you. I'm just walking forward. There. That's where we have to go. boxes lots of unpaid bills I need to remind her that to sort them out hmm maybe Inside your house. What does inside your house mean? I'm standing at the door and I didn't see you come in. Hey Santa, it looks like you broke into the wrong house. Get out of there before you get the freak. Dude. Do I want to check out that? It's like we can't. I want to check out that snow globe right there. Now we're hit. Oh crap! Dude, this is creepy as heck. Is that Santa? Everything will happen today. It will be perfect all day. It'll be our perfect all day, I mean. The ring with a heart. He cannot leave. He's already here. This isn't Joyce's handwriting. Someone was waiting for me here. Wait. Honey, are you there? Now how are we supposed to escape her? Dude. Are we supposed to sneak? What? Alright. Oh. 
This looks sketchy, guys. This looks very, very sketchy. Mark, stop scaring me. I know that you're here. I found the Christmas tree that you knocked over. And why did you take off its decorations? Do you even know how long it took me to decorate it? It wasn't me, Joyce. Listen, I've been locked up here. Joyce, there is some creepy crap going on here. What do you mean it wasn't you? Then who is walking around my house? Mark, seriously, don't scare me like that. What's going on? You won't believe me, Joyce. I think I'm hallucinating. The car door just got bigger. I do not understand what's going on. Let's try. Mark, have you been drinking? If this is some stupid prank, I... I heard something. Mark? Is that you? You told Joyce about strange events. She doesn't believe you. Oh! Oh my... Okay, that's a big hallucination. Dude. It could fit in one of the not notches of that strange door. I need to find three su such globes. <gasps> oh, that's creepy. Sweetie, where are you? This is creepy as heck. Let's celebrate together. She's on that dumb level. All right. Let's just head here. Ah! Honey, don't make me hurt you. This doesn't sound like a Christmas horror game. It really doesn't. That was close right there. That was very close. Right. I wonder where we are now. Oh, it won't open. Oh. I see. I see what you're doing. All right, more sprinklers. How are we down to three? All right. Oh no. Stop running away. 
Why are you hiding? She's dumb. I just found a spark cord. That was the third one. We did it. We did it. What's up with the floor right there, dude? All right, put this all on. Open. Dude. Box with Christmas decorations. Lost and found? Dude, this is... That's just terrifying, dude. We were hallucinating this whole time. But... She's probably still here. I mean, we don't know. She's probably still here. <gasps> right. There's our Christmas decorations back. Oh, Christmas tree. Oh, it's Christmas all some tree. stupid prank, Mark. Moving corridors? What nonsense! I saw your friend in the window and I, I know she's just hiding somewhere. She just moves really fast. And that's it. It's nothing special. Joyce, listen to me. That's not my friend. Hide somewhere and call the police. Let's do that. Let's just assume that I believe you. First, tell me where you are now. What's going on with you? Of course. You accidentally found my stuff in someone else's house. Mark, do you think I'm an idiot? No, of course we don't. Fine. You said I need to hide. I'll do that, and then... I heard something. Dude? I think now we can head to here? Why exactly was she been hiding? I mean, there is the exit. I can't get out, dude. I can't.
This one is with bolt cutters. Delve deeper. The freak is this? Another call from Joyce? Mark! She's here! No! Don't touch me! She... She's gone. <laughs> yeah. It's definitely not a prank. I'm fine. We know that she I isn't human. Just like said, I had time to you just gotta tell us what's going on! I, uh, I launched fireworks at her. It seems to have scared her off. I don't think she likes bright lights. Try to find something similar. Maybe that'll help you. Do you know her? How did she know that I was coming to you? I think we'll- I think we'll do this. Okay. We'll get through this. We have to get through this. Mark, she can come back at any moment. What should I do? Find a flashlight and more fireworks. Try to drive her way with bright light. Let's do that. I'll try. I'll try to call the police, but I don't think they'll arrive here fast enough in this weather. One more thing. Please, be safe. I love you. Is anything gonna happen to Joyce? <sighs> Something's probably gonna happen to her. I just know it. Exactly, what we'll be in here, dude. Oh! What the freak? <laughs> the hell was that? What the hell was that? Alright guys, that's going to be part one of Crimson Snow. If you want to see another episode of Crimson Snow, be sure to like and subscribe. This game is truly terrifying. Anyways guys, I'm Riley Crow, and I'll see you in the next one.